This week on Three Scenes, Two Mansholes, and One Beer. Something wrong with her underpants. Yeah, they're not in my mouth. The 40 year old virgin. This is not a good look for me! And the uh, last beer I had is a virgin. Bush beer. That's fucked up. Stick around, fuck bags. I'm not drunk again. I'm reloaded. Mark Stein. Just say no. You regret it. Just say no. You forget it. Well, Just hello, dear John. No. What's going on? Not much. I got a sample of Viagra after watching uh, 40 Year Old Virgin. Shit. If you don't have 48 hours of fucking or porn planned, don't go nowhere. Or don't fucking take it. Something keep coming up. <laughs> you ain't fucking lying. I blew about 10 fucking loads, and it just kept coming back. It was like Night of the Living Dick. My dick was like on steroids. It's the undertaker of dicks. How many of these loads were someone else? Two. No, three. You don't know. I say two because I had relations with a lady on the first two squirts. Three because I count if they're still in your presence when you spank it. She wasn't happy, but uh, hey... What are you going to do, right? I'm going to say it again. You're probably going to enjoy prison. Yeah, yeah. Anyway, 40-year-old virgin, to which one of my loads was dropped watching Elizabeth Banks <laughs> in that little uh, tub scene there. Can't wait to review that scene. Oh, we'll get to it. Beer? Well, I was going to do Four Hands Divided Sky, but uh, you said something about bush beer. Oh, yeah, because that was the last time, or that was the last beer I had before I lost my virginity to something other than my hand. We used to hide that shit down at the salt marsh and fucking gobble it up. Warm fucking bush beer. I can't drink that shit to this day. But I popped a couple of cold gans this week. Not as bad as I remember. I'm gonna do my best. I was drinking it, but I spent a lot of time paying attention to little Tommy, you know what I mean? I should ever wear off. Yeah, but little Tommy feels like he went to championship rounds of a UFC fight. And it was 100% punches landed. Sure as shit. Pretty sure with uh, his black eye. You want to see? Uh, oh, no. Okay, so can we go to the scenes? We can, but first let's uh, rate this bush beer. Because this is going to be pretty simple. Straightforward. I'm going to give it a whopping 1.2 mugs. In a pinch, I can fucking drink it cold. It kind of erased my childhood days drinking that shit warm. Pretty basic. It's a fucking light lager shit that you get at the fucking store. Cheap. All right. Um, it's an okay beer. I don't mind it. I, I kind of like Budweiser better, but I'll give it a two. I guess we'll push uh, the forehand stuff to next week. The actual good stuff. Oh, yeah. Yeah, sure. So, on with the scenes. Let's just get this one out of the way. We can do it, <laughs> But if you want to. Ouch. See? Little Tommy still wants to get up. Oh. <laughs> Doesn't know the fight's over. Okay, that's not really the scene with her. Oh, I've seen that scene more than the actual movie. <laughs> the scene where Steve Carell is acting like David Caruso and just keeps asking questions to her questions. Are you looking for something? Is there something I should be looking for? That, that is how he acts. But apparently it's very effective. We're blonde. Do you like to do it yourself? Sometimes. <laughs> I mean... Maybe I should try it. Let me know how that goes. Okay. I was being sarcastic. Well, I'm sure I'm going to tell you anyway. I mean, who else do I got to fucking talk to on this shit? Seems to. Oh, you fucker! The one everybody knows. Oh, Kelly Clarkson! Right there. That's how it feels. To try to spank it over and over and over again, and then try to just touch it right now. Ah! Ah! <laughs> 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 Fucking burns. Oh my, just just leave it alone. Bad habit. Like scratching when somebody tells you about bugs, blinking when somebody's talking about your fucking eye, punching clowns, picking my nose, and wiping it under the soundboard. What? What? What did you say? What did you say? You wipe it where? I wipe it where? No, you said... You said you wipe it. Well, I wipe it in the bathroom. No, you boogers, you fucking asshole. Oh, under here. You're a fucking savage. Yep. Anyway, the waxing continues. How? Ouch. Oh, cocksucker, motherfucker! You 
<laughs> Look at her fucking face. She's just laughing her ass off. She's getting off on this shit. <laughs> oh, Mika, you shit burning hell! I know how much I'd enjoy watching Marvin get this done. He is a fucking hair sweater. Just when I thought that dude couldn't get any weirder. He's a Yankees fan. It doesn't get much more fucked up than that. Well, till you meet Marvin. So one last scene brings us full circle to my Viagra clusterfuck of a boner weekend. I just don't want to have an erection anymore. Huh? <laughs> you dumb fuck. Shut up. Felt like I was a fucking 12-year-old again on the back of the bus. Every fucking bounce made me fucking get wood. Anyway, I seen. I'm calling because uh, it's been more than four hours. Huh. Did you call Viagra also? No, you dipshit. I was too busy trying to whack off. And for the record, you only have a limited amount of cum. In that short period of time, and then this fucking red gookie shit kind of comes out. Blood? I suppose. I mean, the consistency was almost like cum, but it was bloody. If I hadn't jerked myself off into having my own period, I may have went to see a doctor. I'd probably go see a doctor. Take your finger and flick your testicle. And if you do that till it hurts, your erection will okay. uh, go. All right. Well, well see, Tom, you could have just did that. Yeah, not funny. Matter of fact, I don't think this whole fucking scene's funny anymore. I think it's hilarious. Sometimes we can't live out everything in the movies, Tom. Otherwise, I'd be like the guy in Strange Brew. Drowning in beer was like heaven, eh? Okay, rating? I like this film. It's got a lot of great jokes, one-liners, and it ends up being kind of a romantic story in the end. Oh, you get all fucking sweet tits on shit like that, don't you? I have feelings, Tom. Okay, Sally, what's your rating? I'm gonna give it a solid four. It ain't perfect, but it's a solid film. I'm gonna go with a three. I think because this film now will always bring back a bad fucking memory of my dick looking like a burnt hot dog. Oh, shit, I'm out. That's gross. Where you going? To puke. Well, fuck. Now I'm just sitting here alone. Let me fucking rewind that clip of, uh... Yes, we're gonna get dirty. Fuck are you doing? Dirty, dirty. Oh, I'm gonna jerk right. off again? It's just fuck about you, time. Fuck you, gross. I'm out of here. See you later, Tom. <laughs> All right, tune in next week. We'll fucking have something. God, the fucking scabs are falling off.